Hi, this is Ken from Origin Lab. In this video, we'll learn how to create column plots with non-zero base values in Origin 2016. Here, we have a column plot with some quarterly data with an x-axis that is set to zero. Though this graph accurately portrays the data in question, it doesn't do a very good job of emphasizing the changes in growth from quarter to quarter. To improve the statistical contrast of this data, let's start by double-clicking on the x-axis to open the dialog box and select the vertical axis window. Since we don't want our y-axis to start at 0 and our lowest value is 0.4, let's set our minimum in the from box to 0.3. Next, click on the grids tab and make sure you still have the vertical axis selected. From here, we can add an additional line to our graph. In this case, let's place this line at y equals 0.5 since our data's maximum is 0.68, placing our new axis square in the center of the graph. Let's click Apply to preview these changes. Your graph should now look something like this. We can clearly see the growth between each quarter, but our x-axis labels could still be improved to show not only the months, but rather the quarter number as well. To add this, let's go back to the x-axis dialog and go to the Tick Labels tab. Then under the Table sub-tab, enable Table Labels. Because we want to show both the month and the quarter number, let's set the number of rows to 2. As you can see, this duplicates the labels to display twice. To show both sets of labels, we need to go back and under display change the data set to Sheet 1B. After clicking Apply, we can see that the table has been updated for both labels.